Good morning. I'm so excited. <laughs> Hi, Penny. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Angela. Thank you guys for coming in. It's Teresa and Tooch. So it's TNT today. TNT. TNT. Hopefully, Ann gets a chance to pop in. She's still recovering and going through some things. So hopefully, she'll be here in a little bit. How have you been, Tooch? I've been great. I've been great. Just hanging in there. Hello, Angela. Hello, Kathy. Hello, Tend to the Sheep. I'm going to include a duck in your Tupperware. I promise. <laughs> a duck? Yeah, that's We've got a lot of Tupperware. He was asking about the ducks. <laughs> yes. Not that I have pl not plenty of them. <laughs> I, it's me, Angie. Hello. Another Angie. Hello, it's me, Angie. Hey. Crochet. Oh, I always have to look at the iPad to see if they're blue or not. Because if you're not blue, we got to turn you blue. Yes, absolutely. Not the sad kind of blue, though. You think you get a happier color? Mm -hmm. <laughs> blue is associated with. Don't worry about it, Penny. Blue is associated with all oh, blue. I'm down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's a happy color here because that's what we want. That's happy. right. That's right. It's another Wednesday morning. <laughs> that's right. Oh, Ten is saying thanks for the ducky. I didn't send you a duck. Did you send no, I'm going to send him a ducky. There you go. We bought a lot on the uh, friend selling with friends. That was fun yesterday, wasn't it? Oh, friends, wasn't it? <laughs> I, I, this has been a really busy week, but I love being busy. I don't like to be in trouble. So where are you going to be this week? This is my last show until I think next Wednesday. I don't have shows, but I might pop up somewhere. You never know. Yeah, I got a lot you of things to get know. done. I got a lot of things to get listed. I got my invoicing and shipping to do from three auctions, four auctions, actually. So I know somebody looking for people for her Monday mornings with Don and Teresa. Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. I am April. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> <laughs> it's too much fun. And you can do this. One. You know that I spent hours looking on YouTube and Google to find out what was going on and what program you're using. And then I found out it's all on the Apple phone. <laughs> it's all on Mac Pro or yep. any Apple device, right? And I'm not much of an Apple person. <laughs> I had, well, I learned on the Tandy, which was the original Apple. Mm -hmm. And I met the guys from Apple and it was like, so I kind of got a stuck there and I'm still stuck, but I, this is my first Mac book. Well, I did work on an original Macintosh. I, that's when there was no IBM big thing. PC compatible, <laughs> yeah. like one of the big tubes. Right. I, I, I had years ago bought a huge lot of those and, um, they weren't worth a lot of money at the time, but what I did is I emptied out all the guts, recycled that, and made them into aquariums. Oh, that's so cool. I have seen yeah. that. that. Yeah, and cool. they sold, like, within seconds. I had, like, ten of them, and they were gone. <laughs> that it was is so cool. cool. You should get chance on more. Probably pick it up. To pick yeah, up. now they're expensive. They're so collectible now. To find one even not working is a pretty penny. Wow. Yeah, they're coming out with a new iPad. Yeah, that was back in the day when they had plenty of them. The offices were just throwing up the upgrading and yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. That's about the only Apple I ever worked with. And then, and then you got it. Proprietary that you couldn't do anything but with Apple. So I was like, no. <laughs> yeah, that's when it was rough. Now you can do everything that you could do on a Windows with Apple, except I find it's a touch faster. Yeah. Yeah. Touch faster. Even my husband said the other day, boy, that is fast. <laughs> he was trying to get to the same website I was trying to get to. Can you tell him Italian? Yeah. And um, <laughs> he was trying to get to the same website, and we were both doing it not as a competition. Just we were looking at, and my I was got there like a good ten seconds before him. He goes, "That was fast." <laughs> yeah. And he keeps me out of trouble, but they are coming out with a new iPad. I'm Ooh. waiting. They're supposed to be out this March. Can you tell yeah, them? I've got this cheaper. I mean, I, I've got two laptops that I've tried to use, and sometimes it bogs up by streaming. And I've got this cheaper Acer 
it's like a combo. It's like a Chromebook that you yeah. use as a, and it is fast and it's the best thing to streaming. I never have any problems with it, so that's why well, that's, I always use the stream. That's good. I've uh, I've had that. The one before this one was one of the gaming ones with the red. Oh yeah, those are fast as heck. Is it MSI or something? Yeah. I don't know. My son picked it out and said, "Here, mom, this will work for you." Oh yeah. <laughs> Just to YouTube, not play games. <laughs> So I got this. My husband's got that now. That's what we do. I upgrade. He gets that one. Yeah, yeah. If he wants it, I don't make him take My it. My sister's family's been doing that. The older one that's in college who's to give to the twins and so right. on and so forth. And then Jimmy, my brother-in-law, will be the last one to get everything and he'd make it work because he's not buying one for himself. He buys it for <laughs> kids. That's how my husband is. It's like, yeah. I'll take it. I don't use it much anyway. <laughs> Everybody here knows that we ship from Massachusetts and New York that way. And we use PayPal. Absolutely. Are any other questions in the chat before we start this fun party? I'll be invoicing tomorrow into Friday. And as soon as it's paid, it will go out. Some will go out on Saturday if it's paid. And everything will go out by Monday. So it's kind of a quick turnaround. And uh, that's about it. We so you're going to make me work really hard. Yeah. I have to invoice and ship in the same week? Ugh. I'm kidding. <laughs> I do. It's actually it's not as uh, bad as I'm gonna, I thought this week. Even having three auctions in, with Dawn's on Friday, too. So it was, that was a lot yeah. of fun, too. Yeah. You guys are doing a great job on Mondays and Fridays. That's fun. And it was fun having you on there. You're coming back, right? Absolutely. I've got three dates booked and I've got a date just booked with you guys on a Monday. Yay. And Monday who knows? Morning. I might be popping in on Mondays every now and again, too. There you go. <laughs> Monday mornings with Dawn and Teresa. Yeah. And Wednesdays with Ann and Tooch and me. I'm here. Yeah. It's okay. I don't mind. Are you ready? And soon in April, there'll be Thursday nights. Oh, right. On yeah. my channel with Yarn Again. And I'm talking to one other reseller and probably some guests. So that'll be fun. A quick night, be little fun. Thursday night auction. You're going to keep me out of trouble and busy. Yeah, absolutely. I like that. I love Not that you don't have enough shows going on or either do I, but it's time. <laughs> yeah, you got to do that. It's time. You got to do that. Ashy, hello. How are you? Hi, Ashley. Welcome in, and we're going to start with Tooch today. Oh, oh I'll be off. Wait, of... Okay, uh, Penny, we'll uh, look forward to seeing you. There you go. You're up. <laughs> <laughs> You're not big. You got to make yourself big by hitting the one in the corner. Oh, okay. The gray corner of your picture. Yep. Okay, we're going to start with this lot of McDonald's tie. I'm going to do a special today on this whole lot for $6. It starts with two Thai McDonald's beers that, that back when you could buy at McDonald's, there is Liberty, so a libertarian beer, and a lefty beer. The righty has already been bought, so that's those two. Along with six, a waddle, which is a penguin, a... That's really his name? I'm sorry, Tooch. I have to ask. Yep. It's waddle on the bag. It's called waddle. Jeez, that's cute. So let's play a little game. Waddle is, of course, a penguin. A penguin. What would you think? Well, this was easy. Antsy. It it's an ant. It's an ant. Anteater. I got yeah. it wrong. You know what that's it was. Pretty. Scoop. Pelican. That's a little harder. It's a that's toucan. A that's, a that's a pelican, sweetheart. This one's easy. Bones. That was a pelican. It's a dog. And the final two. Oh, wait, wait. Ten the sheep wants to know your price again, please. Six dollars for the entire lot. Do I? Did you want me to type these in or is it all right? No, it's okay. Okay. Zip is Zip. a... Kitty cat, and the oh. final one should be an easy one. Peanut, <gasps> a squirrel, an elephant. Oh, 
I got it wrong. You keep saying it's easy. It's, it's easy. okay. <laughs> You're the consolation prize. All <laughs> eight pieces. <laughs> I can't even get. I can't even know name animals. <laughs> All eight pieces for six dollars. Buy it now. Of course, the six tie. This is when they used to give away neat prizes that were cheap and plastic in the tap room. Yeah. And these were an add-on you could buy after buying a Happy Meal. All eight is six dollars, correct? And the two, Lefty and Liberty. Did you want them ten? Just let us know in the chat. And that oh. was an election year because that uh, lefty had the righty too. Yep. No, I had all three of them, and uh, I I put them up about two months ago, and then I just put them away because I've got so much stuff to get through. I bring a bunch of stuff up, go through it, and then put it away and bring it back out later. Yeah. Um, and somebody jumped on the righty there right away. <laughs> Ten will take those. I'll store that for you. Okay, Ten. Thank you so much. Fantastic, thank you. Okay, my next lot is going to be a starting bid of $10. Do your comps on these because they are lots and lots and lots of meat on the bone. These are called Seco Canadian Pewter Teacup Holder. It oh, comes okay. with a glass insert, and the pewter piece has seagulls and it's very ornate. It is pewter. It is unmarked, but from all the Google searches I've done, it is Canadian seagull called teacup holder. There is two of them. Comes with the glass insert and the very ornate pewter piece. It's going to be a starting bid of ten dollars for the both of them. It, Those are you, nice. Your comps. Uh, you'll see there's plenty, plenty of room on the bone for resellers and a great deal for collectors um, if you're having high tea. <laughs> that would tip her up every morning if you had your tea in that. <laughs> Sorry if you hear the birds. He's trying to get in my window. Oh, it's okay. They're part of the family too. They can be part of the show. <laughs> I have a I didn't even bother to take my air conditioner out in, in, in this room. Uh, and there's always birds in the morning that jump on top and tap around, wake me up in the That's morning. What they're doing. <laughs> I have an air conditioner too. So that is a starting with a $10. Just let me know if you see anything on the replay. I like to try to bring some clearance deals and deals to my peeps here on Wednesday mornings for the East Coast resellers. Okay, my final item this round is going to start a little high because it is a beautiful piece. I was asking $28 for it, but I'm going to do it today and today only for $20. This is a Florence porcelain marked porcelain piece. It is marked Florence porcelain. It is a figurine of Marie Antoinette. Very ornate, in great shape, no chips or cracks. I'll show you the back. And again, I'll show you the maker's mark. It is Florence porcelain. It is hand-painted. It is a starting bit of $20. Or the first one in the chat with $20. Can have this beautiful Marie Antoinette uh, Florence porcelain piece. Found these in a nice religious lot that I got over the last week. Oh, sir, that is very pretty. It's amazing to me people have the talent to do this kind of I work know. in porcelain to make it look like uh, an undercoat and lace. Yeah. It's amazing that you found it in one piece because the fingers got, are still there. The yeah, lace. I, I still sold there. two other pieces to Cheryl yesterday. There was an unmarked piece, and then there was a Dresden piece for the Victorian couple, and they were in great shape too. I was lucky enough to buy them at an estate auction online. 
Yeah. And they left them. They didn't even try to box them up. They left them all on the shelf. So I boxed them up, so which was a good thing. Yeah. Those are very pretty. That one is really pretty. The roses on her dress and everything. Oh, it's amazing how they do that. It is raised and it it does it is uh textured to be like uh silk or, or lace. Linen. Yeah. Very, very nice. Any interest? And if there's no interest, we can call that down as a pass. And that's my three. Off to the godmother, Yan again. Da, 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 da. <laughs> that's a good thing, right? She's going to make you an offer you can't refuse. <laughs> yeah. That's it. That's it. I got flowers. These are $4. These are from the sale yesterday. I didn't sell these. So these are the peach with the daisy. And if you want these, I had a number on it, but the number disappeared. Just put in flowers if you want the flowers. They are $4. Buy it now. It's four stems. So you're getting four little bundles of your daisies. We used to call these black-eyed Susan. And if there's no interest in the lovely daisies, I'll call that a pass. I do have the cutest little thing. I thought, and I still, yeah, it's a wine thing, right? But I was thinking yesterday, my husband and I were going through. It's like canvas. It's a wine thing, right? Wow. But my husband likes, this is $5. It's got the wicker bottom. It's from picnic time. And I'll get the dog hair that was on there off. It has a little spot there. Little spot there. Just it, it should it'll come off the damp rag. Hello, Ian. Hope you're doing well. Hi, Ian. Welcome in. Oh no, I'm scaring you on the big spring. Comes with yarn. It doesn't have a full skein, but I'm going to put a full skein of yarn in here. This is just for a sample to see if it would fit. I'm going to put a full skein of yarn in there. That way you could take it and you could take it uh, to go crocheting in your car. It closes up like that so your yarn won't pop out. And we're calling this the Picnic Time Yarn Caddy. And picnic time is coming. So when you go sit on that cruise ship, yes, you could take this with you. It's very nautical. It's meant for a wine bottle, but if you don't drink, you can always use it for that. Absolutely. Or, or, your, be or your beach towel when you go up to the deck. <laughs> that's true. Your beach towel. I wouldn't put a book in it. Kind of get bendy. Yeah. I like hardback books. Because Softback books books books. Books. Yeah. I, I don't books. like reading a book online. I don't either. I, I think we've but, talked about that before. I like having a hard cover, nice book in my hand. And the yeah. smell. I love the smell of a bookstore. Even if it's an old bookstore, but the newer bookstore, I like the smell. Mm -hmm. And you can tell English paper from American paper by the smell. Yeah, It's weird, but you can. Because the English paper uses a different process. And when I was getting my crocheting stuff, I mean, my card making, these are uh, $3. <laughs> I'm just talking. They're size seven. Right. Black shoes. <laughs> you sure want to know what I'm selling. <laughs> anyway, the paper does smell different. What I size are they? Those are a size seven. You add a little black dress and a beautiful necklace. I'm sure one of us has. Oh, black dress with this on it. This is $5. Sorry, I'm adding just because I'm accessorizing. Oh, don't worry. You'd be Wait. ready for a night out in the town. That's right. Now, or the I captain's did. party on the cruise ship. There you go. He's got two weeks off. <laughs> he has plenty of time. I told him, God's honest truth, I told him, um, we're married 38 years, right, this year? I told him he has two years, 40th anniversary, <laughs> didn't mean that, 40th mm. anniversary, it's a biggie. Yeah, absolutely. But I told him that at 25, 30, 35 too, 
Okay. We'll see how it goes. It has Maybe this year we'll give them a little push by putting together a resellers cruise. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. We'll get all, all meet up on a cruise ship. We'll get all the cruise ship videos together and make a YouTube video dedicated to him. Take your wife on a cruise. We're tired of hearing about it. Yeah. <laughs> it's your turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do a, a, a buy it now for $4 because it's Wednesday and there's deals. This is for three Sebastian Miniatures. Again, if you haven't heard me. The Sebastian Ministers were manufactured in Massachusetts by a family called Preston Baston. They called Sebastian Ministers between like 1971 and 2002. This is Shakespeare. It was manufactured probably around 1981. This is Henry VIII. Henry this was on 1982. Him. I one time said Henry the Seventh on a live, and everybody made fun of me. So I do know it's Henry the Eighth now. <laughs> and this is the old salt man who I called. It was Michael yesterday. Oh yeah, this was, was in 1972 and that 84. Was funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I don't know if he thought it was, but I thought it was. It does. <laughs> Are you on this? Are so you on there cool. Sunday? Uh, no, Next in two week, weeks, right? the fourth Sunday yeah. of every month, I'm on there. Okay, I can't. I'm gonna, you know, I'm always there anyway, but I'll be yep. watching. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. That's a lot of fun, too. Almost as much fun as on here. All three of them, four dollars. Buy it now for the Shakespeare, Henry the Eighth, and Michael the Old Salt Man. Just let me know. If not, you're even, not only did you call him the old man, but he's an old salt man. <laughs> all, actually, the old salt. If you can see that. Yeah, I know, but <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> he's not a grumpy old man, though. He's a very, very oh, no, he's curious not. old man. The next lot is going to be a, a buy it now of $10. It is a lot of three, a four blue cobalt pieces. Stop. It starts with this blue. Two. Go back a little bit. There you go. Better. Thank you. A blue. Uh, it's not as incandescent. You can't see through it as much. Unmarked two handle vase. A Emerson uh, Bromo Seltra vintage bottle. It is marked uh, Emerson. Drug Company, Baltimore, Maryland. It does have a small chip right there for the big bottle. A smaller unmarked bottle. I believe it might be a newer Bromo Seltzer bottle. And the final piece is a smaller, it is marked Bromo Seltzer across the bottom. It had a screw top that doesn't come with it. And a smaller blue cobalt bottle. All four of them for the low price of $10. Bargains, bargains today. Okay, and it says no interest in the, the promo ball. We can call that down as a pass. And again, if you're watching the replay and see something that you might want, just uh, let us know. And we'll get it right out to you if it's still available. Okay, my final item this round is going to be a buy it now of $5. It is this Creature Chaos Batman figure, new in the box. It's the uh, kind of the original gray and black Batman. It's from this series that comes with all those four. It is a buy it now. For five dollars for the brand new in the box, Batman Creature Chaos. And there's no interest. You can just call that down as a pass. And off to you, Teresa. Oh no. Oh yes. Yeah. I don't mess around. We have an echo. Echo, echo. Yep. 
My husband makes these bags. That and he told so me cool. to lower them for four dollars. He cannot even get the material for that. So I'm going to do a starting bid of four dollars. This is the queen of everything. Oh, hello. Nice to meet you. I am <laughs> the queen of everything. Oh, I like this side too. It says princess of quite a lot. <laughs> uh, these are so cute. You know, he makes so many. I don't get to see them all. But you get to see them, you know, like that. And it's like, hey, that's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice I'm one. I'm still yeah. on the lookout for uh, Mario uh, yarn. I mean, fabric. So make me a couple out of the. Yeah, Mario I'll have bag. to look into it. Um, he's doing a search for somebody right now. This is uh, reversible to the blue. I'll remember what I'm doing. It's about 17 by 17. Thank you. It made him so pleased that somebody wanted them. He always says, nobody will buy them. I'm like, yeah, they will. The handles match the thing. You can wash these. And they they fold up really small. Got any key one. You have a key I will one. ask him. I will ask him because we are doing a search for um, material right now for someone else. So we'll search for kitties. I don't know if he, ha he might have that one. So they fold up really small. My son gets these in his back pocket. So $4. And Especially with all the places not using uh, plastic bags anymore. It's great to carry around and bring grocery shopping with you. Yeah. And, um, the thing is, I don't think you can get bags in Massachusetts, can you? Uh, paper. We yeah. have to bring our own. Paper. Connecticut's really, you got to bring your own. Yeah. Okay. In Worcester, uh, in Worcester, you have to pay for paper bags. Whether you uh, have one or the, not? Oh, no, no. If you oh. want a bag, you have to pay oh, yeah. for it. Yeah. And she's right. They don't have any plastic, but you, you can buy a regular bag like that or the right. paper bags. That's how it is in Michael in most of the stores here. I don't think there's the dollar quarter store has um, paper bags. My brain will work. This is paper. It's just harder paper. This is a trinket box. This is five dollars. It um, is really really pretty. It is wood. Oh wait, it says something. Fairbanks, Alaska. Oh, you could pretend you went on a trip. Or you can, okay, I'm lowering it to $4 because it has this spot. And I don't know if that's into the stuff. Or look at this it's got a pimple. It's flat. It looks so. like a little paint loss. Yeah. Isn't that cute? That love, great. love the coloring. It looks like water on a beach. Yeah, it does look yeah. like a bean pot, too. Yeah. Like it. Or a witch's cauldron. It's cedar. Oh. Is it cedar? It doesn't smell like cedar. Yeah, it must oh, be wait. like yeah, pine. It might be cedar, but I'm not I'm not selling it for the kind of wood it is. I'm mm -hmm. selling. Please don't yell at me. Oh, look at this. It lines up. That's Laura good. Lai, hello, welcome. Hi, Laura Lai. Welcome in. I don't think she's blue. Has she been here before? Do you have her? Remember? No, I've seen her in other chats, but not blue. If you just fill out the uh, jot form on the top of the uh, chat, and we will smurf you to make you blue just in case you want to bid on something. Or if you win something. Or if you win something, a, a giveaway. Be good to have you as a honorary member of the East Coast Resellers family. Mm -hmm. That's right. It's about two inches, a little shy. By it's a just neat piece. It's really pretty. Okay, thank you, Laura. Okay, no problem. Oh, it's not magic. Like just hanging out. Nice to see you. It's not magic. Thank you for coming in. If you fill out the job form above, you will have the opportunity to buy something or because we need your information to sell you to send it to you. If not, or you just hang out with us. It's fine. Yep. 
Oh, That's you're a okay, Canada. Lorelei. It's great that you're just hanging out with us. Yeah, we, we do ship to Canada the cheapest, but it is expensive. We yeah, understand. Yeah. I have a choice of books for three dollars. They were for yesterday. Discounting. Yeah. Um, Sarah Lane Ruel, the uh, as the NERP. Don't ask. I don't know what it's about. Would you eat an ugly, ugly, scrum, scrumptious, or yumptious chicken maru? I'm so glad my kid can read himself. It's got beautiful pictures. So this is choice A. And it's brand new. It's called the NERP. So that's choice A, the NERP. I've got two of these. It's called Drew Appendix Escape from Treasure Island by the Cool School. They have never been open except for when I'm showing you the pictures. I'm not even opening this. Um, this is a Merlin children's book. It's Drew Drupendous must be a thing. They've got a series of them. Little Drupendices. Oh, thanks. No, it's not magic. It's good to see you. Yeah, the algorithm gets real hungry. <laughs> yeah, it does. And we appreciate all the help we can get. If you could share yeah. us out, we'd appreciate that too. Or you can get this one. Uh, this is Logic. Oh, I think they bought this one for me. Logic Puzzles Even More Mysteries. Ooh. So this is for adults. So you get a choice. The magical... the. Montage Island, magical or mystery. I do know how to speak. I do know how to speak. <laughs> Numbering might be a little hard. That. It's got a spiral round so you can make it nice and flat or you can flip it all the way around so you don't bend your other page. It has the nice little, I got to use my brain puzzles. I can kind of do that one. I don't like doing these. Thank you, Penny. I appreciate you sharing me out. It's uh, I'm, I'm a growing channel. I've only been doing my own videos since, what, December 2? You were on my first yes. one. November 10th, I did my very first. Mm -hmm. It was my anniversary for being on YouTube. I started in the crochet community. It's me, Angie, is in for three. Okay. And that it will be... Oh, it's me, Angie. Is this the book you wanted? Wait a minute. This book? Because I was showing that on last, or is it one of these? Oh, that right, right side up. <laughs> Which one or ones would you like, Angela? Angie... Oh, Easter's coming. They do fit. This will fit nicely in a basket, and yeah. I've got two. Of them. We always got a book every holiday, which meant five or ten because my mom would get us all a book, and mm -hmm. we shared five kids. I was lucky that my father bought me video games every Easter. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have video games. And those now. games, I wish I had today, boy. Ooh. Oh, I the arc. Oh, what is it? The one with the A. Atari. Atari came out. I rode home on my bicycle with it. I was the king of the 2600. A. Hey, he wants one. A. No. All right. Thank you so much. And it's Tucci's turn. Okay. I was asking yesterday and all weekend, a uh, week, uh, $6, but I'm going to do this nice, beautiful Duncan Miller piece for $4. It is a Duncan Miller, kind of a mid-century modern, bubble topped on each, it's kind of offset. It's kind of a nice, strange looking mid-century modern piece. It is a Duncan Miller. It is four dollars. Buy it now for this That's nice. That's cool. I haven't Duncan seen Miller. one like that. Yeah, it's it's I, I think it's so neat. The mid-century modern kind of look that it's off center instead of being just down the middle. Two halves. Yeah. Looking, 
bubble top on each end. That's it's so nice. I like it the is. different. Yeah, I love different pieces. And it is. Thank God I don't have an addiction to clear glass yet. It's the <laughs> yes. it really hurts me. <laughs> I have an unfortunate addiction to Princess House and Waterford is really my thing. But I'm bidding on right now a huge lot of Waterford crystal at an estate sale. I can't afford it. It's so expensive. Mm -hmm. Well, if I get this lot, it's I, I might just send my, my partner in. Oh, don't do that. It's okay. It's <laughs> okay. If there's no interest, we can call that down as a fan. We're going to do both these. It's bargain day for $5 for both of them. They are two Tonka rescue rig vehicles. They're on the card, but the card is you know, got shelf wear on them. They haven't been opened. The first one is a sheriff's vintage type truck, Tonka Rescue Eggs. And the second one is a black, newer, says a little Tonker on the tailgate, uh, Sheriff's Department Rescue Rig. Uh, both of them for the low price of $5. Buy it now for both of them. Bargain days today. Yeah, yeah, I gotta have a bargain year. <laughs> I have got so much stuff. I'm sorry. Can I check with Andy to make Angie to make sure this is the book she wants? Yeah, absolutely. Real quick. Yeah. It's me, Angie. Was this the, this was the first one I showed? This is the one you want, correct? Because you put the first one, and I wanted to make sure. Okay. If it's not, just put no. And okay, gotcha. Back to you, Tooch. The regular okay, schedule. No problem. Both of them, five dollars. Buy it now. And a Tonka at that. Tonka. They don't make. I don't think they make the die casts anymore. They no, still I don't make, think so. They they still make a few smaller Hot Wheels types, but these die casts I haven't seen in a long time. And they still make some of the bigger trucks, but they're all in plastic now. I know my son has one of the um, little dump trucks. Kathy's in for five. Okay, great. You've got it, Kathy. Thank you so much. It was all metal when he was a kid. They were starting to switch to the plastic, but my mom and I searched everywhere because we wanted it to be all metal. Because, you know, the Arizona hot sun on a metal mm -hmm. truck on your hiney. I would say I would want my Tonka trucks when I was young, because I used to have a lot of them, but mine were so well played with. I don't think they... <laughs> oh, this is so Yeah. I used to play in the sand something fierce with them. Okay, my final lot this round is going to be $9 for the lot. It is a lot of Star Wars Attack of the Clones. It comes with a sealed copy of Star Wars 2. Now, this is the fifth movie that came out but if you watch it chronologically it is the second movie star wars 2 but it came <laughs> out as movie. the fifth movie they started with star wars which was actually the third movie in the sixth chronologically so this is a seal never been opened attack of the clone star wars 2 and a limited edition never opened 10 from attack of the clones it is a NECA piece. It is collectible. Never been opened. Very limited edition. Uh, both pieces, a starting bid of $9. For your Star Wars fan. Great in a Star Wars Easter egg. Trying to get rid of a little bit of my Star Wars collection. Being I'm very mad at Star Wars now because they ruined the... Uh, yeah, that's what I heard. Yep. It is a second prequel, exactly. But it is the actually the fifth movie to come out. It was uh, Star Wars, uh, Return of the Jedi, Empire Strikes Back. I always get those two mixed up. And then New Hope, Attack of the Clones, and then the third movie. So just no interest in the $9 two Star Wars pieces, both brand new, never been opened, 
never been played with. It is empty. People ask if there's anything in it. Uh, Nine dollars, and if there's no interest, that is a pass. And that's my three trees. Are you ready? Yes, ready as I get. <laughs> ah, I have some more books. They're children's and um, young adult reading. Ten the sheep. I've got a bunch of trekky stuff that I'll bring next week. You do? A bunch of Star Trek stuff. Ooh. Bunch of paperback books and stamps and stuff like that. So I'll bring that all next week. I'll dig it out. That'll be cool. These are the three books I have up for offer. Now you get to choose A, B, or C. Or actually just put 1845 if you want this one. This is Iron Sky Dread Eagle by Alex Wolf. It looks to me like a young adult. Um, it has not been cracked except for that time. These are brand new. We got them at Barnes and Noble. And we have, I have, I always say we because my husband and son helped me with this business. This is a Sterling book, number three. And it's called Upstaged by Zach De La Cruz. Upstaged. Uh, this is uh, the Davy Crockett Middle School production. A Christmas Carol takes center stage. Jack, Zach, excuse me, wants to win the role of Scrooge and Abba's admiration too. So that's what this is about. I saw that. It reminded me of uh, Scooby-Doo. And then I saw the ghost. I thought it was Halloween, but it's not. It's um, apparently Scrooge, Scrooge movie your show. So that's kind of cool. And this one I should have read is about France and Britain continue their long and bloody war for a global submerged Super Marcy, I, I, um, I left my brain at home. Breathtaking adventures. Oh, wait, I am home. So these are $3. Buy it now. I'm bored. I can't tell you what this book is about. I can tell you I have three. It's got a walrus on the front. It's by Jess Rotter. It is sealed. I didn't know they sold they sealed books. But it is sealed. I'm bored. Except, oh look, he's got an ACDC shirt on. Eh, this is the back of the book. So I don't know if this is children's or like a, like a fun book, like a jokey kind of book, like a quick read for an adult. I don't know. So I would say a teenager with the ACDC shirt and the I'm bored. This kind of reminds me of the... Um, on Capitol Hill, they're making the bill. What was that guy? I don't know. Remember Saturday mornings, he would come on, and he was the he would walk up. To... <laughs> oh, oh yeah. <laughs> and and the one I, I remember most. About the bill of rights and all... Right, the one I remember yeah. most was "I'm a bill on Capitol Hill," and he's yeah. like it looks like a little piece of paper, and he taught history. And the, and the judicial system and all that. It was Saturday in, in winter time. Was that too? Yeah, that was too. Saturday winter time um, in New York. Then my sister and I would play chess. I have a bouquet. These are one, two, three, four picks. You get four picks here. Wait, one, one, two, three, four. Five, six picks. Oh, you didn't see that one. These are gorgeous. One, I think my husband got these for me. Don't tell him. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, six. These are really pretty. These are three dollars. I was selling them yesterday for four, but I have to get this stuff moving. And this cute is put five sixteen in if you want it. 
I'm cute. Oh, good, Penny. I'm glad you remember. Those are fun days. This would make a nice hat, a fascinator. Look at that's cute. Like if I was going to a wedding in England, I'd be like, oh, that is cute. I like that. Hi, everybody. <laughs> so, welcome in. I guess I am a fastener kind of person. That, my darling, is my third. <laughs> it is so posh. It's so posh. <laughs> okay. We're going to do something a little bit different today. I've got a lot of mugs, some with coffee, some without. Um, is that Angie Isaac in for three? Oh, okay. You got it. I'll put it aside for you. You've got it with the posh talk. Yes, I know. Yeah, I can do this all day. <laughs> we're going to do these. I was doing these $6 each. But what we're going to do today uh, is you can pick any two of them for $7. And if you just happen to want all four sets, I'll do all of them for $22. So it's pick two for seven dollars or all of them all four sets of two for twenty two dollars we'll start with this niagara That's falls deal. mug with a bag of door country from tracy cakes breakfast run coffee if you've seen me show these before it's because i overshot at tracy cakes so i'm including coffee with some of these this is a Bureau of Engravings and Printing, Fort Worth, Texas, and Washington, D.C. mug. That's another choice. Again, you can pick two for $7, or if you want all eight, it's $22. This is a Happy Island, one Happy Island Jamaica mug with a Highlander Grog bag of coffee. What choice is a vintage SeaWorld mug with a little dolphin riding it out on the handle? Not good for the microwave or dishwasher. The tag marked SeaWorld with a bag of Country Morning Blend coffee. Um, one McDonald's, very well made. I remember these from my childhood. McDonald's cup. This one is Epcot. From the 2000 Millennium Celebration. Another choice is Disney Studios. McDonald's mug from Disney Studios. The 2000 Millennium. Uh, next is a Disneyland Vintage Mom mug. It says Mom on the handle. Mom's Day coming up. It says Disneyland inside. And the final choice is a... 1994 Rose Bowl champions, Wisconsin Badgers, my alma mater. Uh, mug, they won the uh, they won 10 1 and 1. There's their schedule, uh, and it is pick two, uh, for seven dollars. And if you want all of them, it's 22 dollars. Uh, Niagara Falls, and there's not a state one. It's it just uh, Fort Worth, Texas, and Washington is easy for the Bureau of Printing and Engraving. They print money in Fort Worth, Texas, probably around Fort Knox, and Washington. Did you want those two, Ken? I am sitting here having a whole conversation with you. <laughs> I was. Did you, did you answer yourself? No, I was wondering why you were ignoring me. <laughs> I was like, Ken wants to know about the Niagara and the uh, state one. Yep. She would like uh, Niagara and Jamaica. Oh, you got it. Thank you. That Niagara and Jamaica. Those are two fun, fun mugs. Yeah, they are. And the coffee's coming your way. And the coffee is tremendous. <laughs> Anybody else uh, for the other ones? If not, we can call the rest down to the test. Thank you so much, Ted the Sheep. Okay. 
scared if it goes out of the way. Next item is going to be a buy it now of five dollars. It is two Tesla Vodka five gallon hat shot glasses. It says Kessler Red right Across, which is a vodka brand, uh, and it's shaped like a ten, five gallon hat. It comes with two identical five gallon hat shot glasses. Buy it now for five dollars. These are kind of neat to do some whiskey out of when you're watching Urban Cowboy or Bonanza. Or my favorite old show. I used to love watching F Troop. Oh my god. Oh, oh I loved god. F Troop. <laughs> what a show that was. It was so I terrible. went to their um studio. Really? Wow. Yep. F Troop Studio when I was six years old. I remember it like it was yesterday. My grandma and my Aunt Barbara took me. It was hotter than beans on a plate. I tell you what, it was hot. My first I have an old Sierra put away somewhere from F Troop, and I'm kind of glad because I bet you you won't see that on any streaming services. Oh, no. Because <laughs> <yeah. laughs> no. it was hysterical. That and my, one of my favorite movies was Blazing Saddles. <laughs> yeah, you won't see those on stream TV. So these are two Kessler those shot so glasses. Cool. Uh, buy it now for $5. You are welcome, Tender Sheet. Sometimes when I'm showing, I don't watch the chat as studiously as I should. <laughs> and I'm yelling at him with the chat, people, but you know what happens is something. <laughs> I would never ignore my godmother. <laughs> That's good. I, I got I'm the first size. Sure. Oh, what yeah. was the other one? Very, yeah. <laughs> what was the other one that was on? It was F Troop, and then there was the German one. They followed back to back, which made no sense to me as a kid. Was it Bonanza? No, Bonanza is not German. Oh, German, German, German. Oh, was it Hogan's Heroes? Yes. <laughs> I, I know nothing. I see nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the next item is uh, going to be a buy it now for all three of these for eight dollars. Deal. I've been asking ten and twelve for them. These are Welch's jelly vintage glasses. They came with jelly in them with a cover. But when I was a kid, I used to empty all the jelly out of them <laughs> because too. I used to love drinking out of them. My mother used to get so mad at me. I think I've told this story a hundred times. You're probably sick of hearing it. <laughs> Just like my cruise. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and there's two of them. It says Welch's across the bottom. And it's also included this Tyrannosaurus Rex. T-Rex. Welch's Jelly, jelly jars can be used as glasses. Very vintage. $8. Tom and Jerry's, very collectible. Yes. I used to watch that all the time. When oh, I, was I know. Kids. Every day after school. <laughs> I used to feel bad for the poor cat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that I used to always pray for him to get the road running, too. <laughs> All three, eight dollars. Uh, buy it now. Okay, that's a pass, and that's my three, Teresa. That was your three that went fast. Yes, we go fast when we're having so much fun. We do. Okay, now it's like we could be related. I tell you, we'd be so much <laughs> absolutely. It was my very first trip on an airplane. I went with my older sister. Oh, hello, yes. Kitty. Thank you. My brain fell out of my head. I'm sitting here going. Da, 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 da. <laughs> hello, I'm, Kitty. I'm yes. glad I have someone here and I ditch that knows hello, Kitty. <laughs> hello, Kitty is four dollars. Buy it now. All his, uh, all her, all its uh, glitter and glam is there. It is not marked. It um, is on a, see the cord is a little bit like the kind of rubber cord, but it does have a, um, it does have a tag wrapped in there that I have to get off. 
but it has a lobster claw clasp with these little springy things. They don't stretch, so please don't pull it. It has approximately a two inch, three inch doohickey there. And that is the Hello Kitty. I almost called it Holly Hobby. Great for Easter basket or some little girl to wear. Or me girl. It would fit. I would wear it on black. So four dollars. Just put Hello Kitty if you are interested in this and it will come in a gift box. Here are the birds. Those are God's birds. They sit outside my window on my air conditioner, and I think she had baby birds. And they're they're right out there. I swear they're trying to come in. <laughs> my next item will be three dollars. You get both of these little things to needlework. Um, it says it's cross stitch, which it's cross stitch. You cross stitch on the pieces of wood. There, you can see it there. And it comes with three designs that you can cross stitch. I like that design just for anything. That's real pretty. And oh, look at that. It comes with uh, more than one little. It comes with three little butterflies, guys. I thought it only came with one. I'm trying to get you so you could see them. Anyway, comes with the three little butterflies. This comes with the one little um, egg. It comes with these designs that you could put on the egg. It does not come with the floss. That chicken on the egg would be cute. These are cute for a kid. This is a wooden charm five-piece set. I don't know what the fifth piece is unless they're counting the instructions. Which, by looking at it... <laughs> By looking at it, I just read that 10. That was it, a freaky movie, too. Yeah, it's just, um, my dad thought that was funny to show me all the time, too. It scared the living crap out of me. Pardon my words. That is we had a tradition the day, night before we fly anywhere on vacation as a family, we'd have to watch Snakes on a Plane. Really? I've never seen that movie. Was it good? It oh must my god, be. it's scary. <laughs> it must be. I'm sure there's been snakes on a plane. Yeah. Was that one? That was two. It, it was one. Keep on it was going. not. Okay. No, it was not. <laughs> All three for twelve dollars. I'm that tired of these stamps. This is stamping up brand new in the box, never ever used. Attention shoppers, blue light special. <laughs> it is because you know what? These go for $30 a pop sometimes. This one has been used. They got the things, but they're in good condition. I don't I don't sell garbage. I wouldn't want it, and I'm not gonna try to try to give it to somebody else. And this one you make all the balloons. You get these, you put them down, yeah, yeah. This one has two that were used. Um this these pieces here were used. Absolutely. So um especially in the garden plane, we're nowhere to go. <laughs> I have garden snakes, so and you can't shoot them in the plane because you're gonna kill yourself. Yep. Decompress so the cabin. Right. Twelve dollars to get all three of these. Hi, Pearl. Thank you for coming. It's funny you say that because I had a friend that was a Secret Service ag agent, and we were watching that show in the Line of Fire or that Harrison Ford movie about him being the president. That was good. And they were using guns in the airplane, and he's like shaking his head because he was a Secret Service agent because. See, no Secret Service agent would ever use a gun inside a plane. No, it's suicide. Yeah. And seeing no interest, I will call this a pass. Hi, Pearl. And that, my dear, was my three. Okay. 
There you go. Oh, look well, at that little paw. We're going to do a special on these two brand new backpacks. Today, today only $3. They are brand new at tags. There are two of these available. This is a possum backpack. Brand new, never used on a Paw Patrol possum tag. Nickelodeon, Nick Jr. They are brand new. There are two of these available for $3 each. And there's only one of these available. This is Elsa and Anna with a tag, Frozen 2. Uh, new with tags, backpack, $3 for choice. The two possums, there are two of these available. And the one, Elsa and Anna, how cute they are. It's about the last animated movie that they didn't really ruin, Frozen 2. Uh, $3 choice. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's do a few bottles. We'll do all three of these for $7. These, again, are smaller. Emerson Drug Company, Baltimore, Maryland. Vintage Bromo bottles. We'll do them for $6. All three of them for $6. They have the markings on it. Bromo Salsa, very vintage. They all three are the same. This one, I, I don't know what that is inside. It's probably a little dirty or something that we get out. And this one, all the same. Great shape, vintage Bromo bottles. When everything used to come in glass from the pharmacy. And a lot of it was experimental. <laughs> So six dollars for all three of the vintage Bromo Seltzer Cobalt Blue. They look good with a little bit of a LED light underneath it or behind it on the shelf. Six dollars for all three. And again, if you see anything on the replay or before the end of the auction that you that either myself or Teresa shows, just let me know. And uh, if it's still available, we'll, still, we'll get it back to you. Okay. We're going to do three quick lots of Pez. They're going to be $7 each. But I'll do all three lots for $17. So there's $17 each. $7 each. Or $17 for all three lots. This front lot is kind of a weird lot with a bunch of birds. Funky bird. A little dinosaur. This funky looking character. A Honeycombs Mini Pez. A brand new in the package alien. Another yellow brand new in the package alien. A little bit of a clown for those of you who love clowns. Keychain. Mini heads. A emoji. Pez. And the final one in this lot of A is a mini bird. That is lot A. For seven dollars. Oh, 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 oh! Hold on. Yep. You, I, I seen Tweety, or a bird. Is that yep. the one with Bugs Bunny? No, no. Okay. That's these are. Uh, I don't even know where they're from. This almost looks like a cartoon dino. Okay. But these are kind of uh, very sad. They're like I don't know what they're from. If they're from a cartoon, I think it's from an overseas cartoon. Oh, that's from the duck cartoon. Yep. Yeah. Sorry, I thought I saw Bugs Bunny. I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. No, I have a little lot of Bugs Bunny. Come you on. have a lot of Bugs Bunny? Uh, Looney Tunes, yes. Oh. This is a Christmas lot for a bee. It includes a reindeer, new in the package. A snowman. A cute little polar bear with a cap. Another reindeer, maybe Vixen. Of course, Santa Claus, if you're going to do it. 
Another type of bear with a Christmas hat. Yet another Santa Claus. You can never have too many Santa Clauses. Three Santa Clauses in this lot. A cute little penguin. And the final one in the B lot is the elf, of course, to help Santa. That is B lot for $7. The final lot for this round is a boy's lot, I call it. Oh, Gina, Regina says that the one with the dino is from the Flintstone. Is it? It kind of looks like it. It looks like Dino, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Look at the side profile. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, kind of. Or the dino. Like Thank you. Okay, this is a boy's lot. Comes with a motorcycle helmet, brand new in the package. Another color motorcycle helmet in the package. These are kind of cool. This is a truck, 18 wheeler Pez. Two Boston Red Sox, different Pez. A another white, different color helmet. A different colored yellow truck, a green truck, two more helmets. So did I, Pearl. Oh, helmets. And a final helmet. All those for $7. A for the birds and Dino and aliens and honeycombs. B for the Christmas lot for $7. C for the boys' lot, Red Sox, helmets, and trucks. A boy's dream. Or if you'd like all three of the lots, it's $17. And just let me know if there's any interest. Even on the replay. Hi, Regina. And we'll get them out to you if you're interested. Okay, and we'll away. I think that's two, right? That's two. No, wait. Yeah, that's two. It was a long two, but I got Might have been one. Do two more. <laughs> okay. Okay. I always listen to the godmother. Okay. There you go. You know, you know what I'm talking about. I don't want any cement shoes. No, I got plenty of little galoshes. <laughs> galoshes in these boots over here. <laughs> okay. I'll do two at the same time. This is uh I'm gonna do six dollars each for these. If you want them both, this is a deal, y'all. It will be ten dollars. The first piece for six dollars is this nineteen sixties anchor hawking. Um, it's called Sunburst. So vintage pretty. candy dish, a trinket dish. You can do a lot with this. It's a green glass anchor hawking piece from the nineteen sixties. A for six dollars, or for six dollars, this is a great deal. This is an anchor hockey. I originally thought I think it's early anchor hawking, just about when the time where anchor bought the hawking company. I originally thought it was a hawking piece, but it is an anchor hawking. It's called the Manhattan pattern, it's kind of mid century modern, kind of looks like a skyscraper, dual handled glass dish. For six dollars. If you'd like them both, you can have them for ten dollars. So six dollars for choice. If you'd like both of these vintage depression glass green and pink dishes, both anchor hawking, it's ten dollars. I'm weird. I just love showing glass and learning about oh, glass. That's 
<laughs> That's not weird. I tell you, if I didn't have an accident-prone husband, I'd have a whole lot more glass in my house. <laughs> and Hi, he knows Robin, how, to say that. how are you? Thank you for coming in. Hi, Robin. Hi, Pearl. Everybody that's just come in, thank you so much for coming by. We appreciate it. Please give, give us a thumb and share us out. We appreciate that, too. Absolutely. We're here every Wednesday morning, and we're going to be starting to bring in a lot of different things, giveaways, in the upcoming week. So look out for it. Again, $6 each or $10 in April. In April, we're going to start a show on Tucci's channel. Well, Tucci's starting to join his channel. April, probably the first and third Thursday nights at 6 p.m. in April, me and Yarn are going to do a show with guests. So yes. look for that on my channel. TNT. Uh, TNT with guests. TNT, we'll call it. Yeah. <laughs> East Coast resellers present TNT. And either in April or May on a Friday night, I'm going to be gone doing a show called Tooch of Glass. Oh, that's a cool name. I like and that. I'm going to be doing that with uh, Two All Guys Vintage and the Revive It Sisters are going to pop in and out of the show and also uh, Rita and Wing, Chicken Wing. So they're all going to be part of a great show about glass to learn, show pieces from our collections. And sell a little bit of glass and hopefully teach you something about glass. I'm willing to learn. <laughs> I'm always willing to learn. If there's a day when you can't learn, you, you wasted a day. Yeah, absolutely. Aisha, how are you? And that's my four. Hold on. Can you do one more? Oh, wait. Yeah. I can do one more. And then read your text on your phone. Okay. I will. <laughs> I hope that's okay. I texted you. No, nope, it's fine. It's perfect. You can text me anytime. You can call me anytime. Vice versa. I'm going to do this for $18 today and today only. This is a really, really cool piece. If you can find comps, there are plenty of room on the bone. This is a vintage National Biscuit Company tin. It's very ornate with a handle. It had a key... But it's just kind of a rental for the key. I love that thing. It has National Biscuit Company on each side. If you don't know, this is pre-Nabisco. The National Biscuit Company made biscuits and became Nabisco. They took the N-A, the B-S-I-C, and the O to become the National Nabisco. So this is pre-Nabisco. It is a nice, nice tin. You know, little bumps and bruises from the age, but it is a starting bid of $18. And the only one I saw went for a lot, lot more than that. But I love my peeps on Thursdays, so I bring it to you in. Today's Wednesday, though. Excuse me? Are you Wednesday, two timing yeah. us? Today's Wednesday. <sighs> You said, I love my peeps on Thursday. That's why I'm bringing them this deal. So I'm we can't buy it until tomorrow. Nights. There'll be deals on Thursday nights, too, in April. <laughs> okay. So we can't buy it today. We have to wait until Thursday. Okay, bye. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Did you read that? Yeah. Yeah. I'll check that out in a second. We we I had my son check it down. Mm. My turn. All that gone. Can out. That can be straightened out very easily. That's what I'm. That's why it I had, it, it happened to Nady Pie. That's what I thought too. But you know what? Not my place to say anything. So yeah. Mattress lifter. Um, you put this under your mattress. It lifts up your mattress so that if you have the dexterity of having the lift mattress or you have to do it by yourself, shove this under there and you can change your sheet corners. Two dollars. I've got two in uh, blue and I've got two in pink. It's a break of my heart. And that's a pants and lanyard. And then I have another bouquet of flowers. I'm selling more flowers than my husband ever gave me. 
just the like the just the crackers and the stuff they make Nabisco. <laughs> just the stuff they make. They're Nabisco owns a lot of different brands now. It's a huge conglomerate. I know, and so does Kraft. Yeah. I seen a thing where seventy five percent of the stores are owned by two companies. Mm -hmm. Nabisco probably owns the two. Ladies. Yeah. Sorry. These flowers are four dollars, three dollars. I lowered the price. You get them all. This would look really pretty in a vase. And they are, there's two, the chunky ones. See, you get this one and then this one. So you could take this out for Christmas as well. Use these for fall, spring. Yeah, I know it's got the leaves in there, but you know, it's a pretty color. $4. You can get married with it in the fall. Dum, dum, da, dum. You ever wonder why they have that song? Which one? Dum, dum, da, dum. Dum, dum, da, dum. <laughs> or is it just me? Well, well, you've been married for 38 years. You're talking to somebody who was married for like a year and a half and together for five months. So. <laughs> took me longer to get the board. I knew eight months. I knew him eight months before I got married. And every once in a while, we just joke about that. Dum, dum, da, dum. Mm -hmm. This is $5. It's a doily. It is so pretty. I'll put it on the black. See how I know that's not where you put it, but that's pretty. Party. It's five dollars. It I don't know if it's handmade or not. I don't think so. I don't know, but you can look at the detail. It's gorgeous though. You put this on a round table at your entry entry hall. If you don't have a hand entry hall, you can fold it in half on a entry hall half table. You can put it on your table, no matter what the shape, because that'll break up the rectangle shape and have a nice bouquet of flowers on top. See? It'll look nice. So, uh, Penny's in for five. Thank you very much, Penny. I should have said it was a buy it now. I'll put this with your bag from yesterday and change that for you. And that is sold. That was my second. I'm just going over here digging in a thing. Whatever I pull is what we get. So if you guys want to see something, um, oh, you're good. I, I claim I got you, uh, Penny. Thank you. This hat I put it on yesterday for four dollars. Um, so I'm gonna do four dollars because it does have a tag in it. It is your denim material, 100% cotton, which is denim, I guess, right? It is by the Fur Talk Company. It's so good. It's in the back of my chair. It is <laughs> washing care, hand wash, cold water. We all know we're not going to hand wash this. Yeah. <laughs> Apply heat, ironing, bring back original shape. Okay. I don't think I'm the only one that does not and wash my hats iron my hats i have one of those uh cages that you can put yeah. a hat in and yeah. you, can throw it, you can throw it in the uh washing machine and the dryer the little hat prison if it's yeah. if this They're is great just, if this was um just 100 percent cotton granted don't dry it it's you know yep Half the time in the summer, summer you're you're getting wet at the lake, the beach, or whatever. Yeah, you get anyway. a little sweat wide across them. Yeah, so you just rinse it off. If you have to hand wash it, I throw it in with the clothes. They throw eat it, it when they wash, and you leave it in the cage to the dry, air dry. Yeah. They stay pretty straight. They stay formed. They really work. And it's got the pre-bent <clears throat> bill. It's not a flat bill. It's the 
not the yeah. military bend, but it's never the, understood the flat bill that all the kids wear flat bills. With the stickers on you them. You have to have it perfectly rounded when I and I just spent hours in the mirror making sure one end wasn't lower than the other. Right. <laughs> I don't understand a lot of things these people wear these days. Okay. I would never go to Walmart in my jammies. Just telling you. Yeah. your turn. That was a princess house. You're up. Oh, I am? Okay. I'm sorry. That was my third, I think. I was looking away. This is going to be $8 for all four. This is Highlight Plains by Princess House. The Starburst design. They are four. They are not marked P. The newer Princess House pieces generally have a P on them, but the earlier pieces do not. They came with A lot of them came with stickers that are Never really all fall off, kind of like Fenton used stickers early. And some of the newer Fenton pieces are marked with an F. There are four of these. They all are in great shape with a Starburst by Highlight Plains by Princess House Coasters. $8 for all four of them. They're nice. If I used a poster, I probably should more often. <laughs> okay. Um, we're going to do $7. Buy it now for this lot. This is the aforementioned Looney Tunes Pez lot. It also has got some peanuts mixed in. The first one is Charlie Brown. The second one is Woodstock. The third one is a brand new in the package, Charlie Brown. Comes with two Tasmanian Devils. <gasps> two. Of course, you can't have Looney Tunes without Bugs <gasps> Bunny. How much is this lot? Seven dollars. Oh. Bugs Bunny, Speedy Gonzalez, hey, Speedy Gonzalez, Sylvester, Yosemite Sam, <gasps> and the final one is Snoopy. Uh. Buy it now. Seven dollars for the entire Pez Looney Tunes lot. Finally, getting down to the end, so I put together some lots of the end of this huge Pez lots. I've had Pez for days. We're finally getting down to and look forward to the next couple of weeks. I'm going to sell one huge lot once. To, to get rid of the rest, out of clearance. So, <laughs> and if there's no interest, okie dokie. <laughs> there's no interest, we'll call that down as a path. Kind of. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know how to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to do uh, this lot. Let me do two lots. Uh, these are going to be $7 each. If you want both these lots, it can be $12. This is a lot of angel pins. Choice A and choice B. The first lot... Sorry. It's okay. Oh, angels, we have heard. Hi, uh hi. -huh. I will call him. This is a, I think it's guiding an angel. Smaller one. This is a little faux pearl snowman type angel. This is a larger angel pin. 
These are unmarked. Oh, this is maybe marked. What a perfect gift for the angels in your life. No, this is just ornamental. It is not marked. Everybody has that special someone in their life. I'm sorry, I'm crinkling. This comes from the Auburn Western uh, VMA Hospice. It is a rock angel. Oh, sure, cool. I might have been giving up uh, to somebody in hospice or a family member to give them comfort. This is a another angel, and the final angel in this first lot is this little angel here. That's the first lot for seven dollars. Uh, this is the second lot for seven dollars, and if you want them both, you can have them both for twelve. This is the B lot. This is a little bit more sparkly angels. This is the first one, a little sparkly angel on this card. Comes with this angel with little two stones down in the bottom. It's a cute little angel here. Uh, three more in this slot. I think this one's called a guardian angel. Uh, another little stone angel. And the final one in the second stone one angel, not stoned angel, is this little glass angel. That is lot B for seven dollars. Lot A for seven dollars. Or if you want them both, yeah. <laughs> um, you want them both? It will be twelve dollars. Stick around, Pearl. If, if, if there's any that you want or any particular one, I can go through what I have left. Hi, Johnny. Hey, Johnny. And that's a pass. Let me know if you see them at a later date and you want them. And that's my three. Uh, just to, to do another one. Okay. Please, sorry. No problem. Um, why don't we do this lot? This lot is going to be ten dollars. This is a lot of religious medals or pendants, and it includes a cross too. Uh, this is a cross. Don't think it's a pendant because it has nothing to it. It's just a little giveaway cross. It has an angel pendant, none with chains. It has a Mary, or this is a, yes, no, this is a, yeah, Mary pendant. This is a sacred heart of Jesus, Jesus pendant. This is another Jesus pendant. And the final one in the lot is this is a pendant from the Sacred uh, Heart Auto League. Oh, they used yeah. to mail those to you. Yep. Yeah. So it is uh, five pendants, religious pendants, and one cross for the whole lot, $10. And I'll put together... The three lots, the two angel lots and the pendant lot, if you want it, for $18 if you want all three. So it's $7, $7, $12, or $18 for all three, or $10. Thank you. For angels and religious pendants. Angels we have heard are hard. <laughs> that um, Sacred Heart of Jesus uh automobile thing is vintage yeah i saw and i i saw a lot of these online i did not find any 925 but a lot of these were silver but i'm not guaranteeing they're silver but i couldn't find 925 on them that so might I'm just be selling it as a pendant. those are nice i i have a ton of religious items so yeah like yeah those are nice ones Hi, Casey. Welcome in. Hi, Casey. 
Welcome in, everyone. I appreciate you guys coming. It is such a nice thing to have everybody here. Yes, it's wonderful. And I'm trying to get back to my YouTube page so I could go, and it's my turn, right? Like, yes, it is. Let's look at professional and all that stuff. And I'll be right back in one second. <laughs> okay, let's all act professional because, you know, I'm supposed to be. But I try to be fun. I have shocker let's say it together a bag my husband made this one is double material but not reversible and um one of his first ones this is the united states army which we really appreciate their service and that one's it's upside down dude it's still four dollars but it's upside down just hold it this way it's a it's a bag. It says army. It's all upside down, and I didn't realize it until now. So I'm just gonna put that over here. I won't tell them. I will tell them actually, because I can't carry it. I'm not an army person. This is a diamond art kit. This is one of the bigger diamond art kits. Um, this is. Let's see what this is because I have no. Oh, how pretty, guys. It's a waterfall in the fall. <laughs> it's a waterfall in fall. It is so pretty. This is, what did I say, $8? Thank you, Casey. I'll make you blue after my in a second after my turn, okay? Thank you so much. It's a beautiful waterfall. And here's the little beads that go with it. And here's the little tray with the wax and the pen. What you do to do these, they're all numbered and got the information on them. See the T? So you would take all the beads that are marked T. And you would put them in the little tip here. The wax, you dip, dip your pen in wax, this part. And then you pick up your beads. Personally, I buy the ones, and I'll have ones next week that are wider, so you can do five beads at a time. Because on this kind of stuff, it gets monotonous. So if you want this, it is $8 for this size. And it is a biggie. Um, it says it's 40 by 30 centimeters. So... If there's any interest, this is really a pretty one. And my next item, oh, sorry, the all the ASMR, I think that's what it's called. Um, so, um, all the ASMR. I don't mean to do that. I don't. I have this trinket box for three dollars. It is wood. No, it's not. It's not wood. It's cardboard wrapped with paper. And on the outside, it's been treated with like the decoupage or something to make it shiny. And you can wipe it off. The inside is just the paper. And this is three dollars. It's got the flowers on it. I would say it's a four by four square. I mean, rectangle. It's not a square there. Thank you, Casey. It is a five inch from point to point. It is. It is two inches tall with the lid. It is one and a half inches tall without the lid. There's a bunch of um, Dee Dee's Caramels can fit in here. Dee Dee's Sweeties can fit in here. If you have not tried Dee Dee's Sweeties, go to Dee Dee's Sweeties at gmail.com. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> and you can get Dee Dee's Sweeties and a little extra on your hips for the winter so you're nice and warm. But they are so good. But they would fit in here, make a nice little Mother's Day gift. Um, and that is my second item. 
And my third item is these floaty candles. These floaty candles are two dollars. You get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Two dollars. They're white. They float. I believe they float. They're oval. They're they're um wax, so I'm pretty sure they're gonna float if you put them in water. Technically, any candle will float if you put it in water. But they're about an inch and a half long sort of circumference there. And uh, that is my... Oh my gosh, that's my floors. I did the upside down bag. I'm sorry, Tooch. What? Your turn. I did four. No, 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 finish showing that, please. Go ahead, finish showing that, please. I did. Please. It's just candles. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm doing the Denise thing. It's just candles. Nobody wants them. <laughs> okay, I'm going to do a buy it now for this lot of $20. And I'll show it. It starts with this R2D2 piece. Now, it does work and it lights up, but the batteries are dying. So these three things light up, but the batteries go here and they are old batteries that are dying. So it does work. And it comes with three bags of Star Wars potato, Mr. Potato Head Star Wars pieces. It comes with all these hands and lightsabers to make multiple. It comes with one body, and I just put it on both ends. This is a Darth Vader and a Darth Maul. <laughs> so I just put it together that way. That's the first bag for $20. Oh, excuse me, Tooch. Nanette is here. I, Welcome I in, Nanette. I'll, I'll show it next, Nanette. That'll be just your arm re-showing. It doesn't count. And let me just finish doing this. This is C-3PO. It's complete. And R2-D2, which is just missing the cap to it. So that's the second in the lot. And the third pieces in this lot is enough to make two full stormtroopers of the cap and the face. And all that for $20. All that can be yours for the low, low price. I bet that cost a whole heck of a lot more than that. It, when you it, this stuff you could only get in Disney World. They used to have a few pieces put together. Like they used to have like a R2-D2 in a package. But they used to have these big, big things of just parts and parts and parts. And you just buy a big Mr. Potato Claire and you fill it up. <laughs> and it was like $35 for the, the bass to fill up. So just let me know if those are available. Okay. I'll reshell this piece from the net. It's a beautiful piece. It is Marie Antoinette. What did I say today? Was it going to say twenty dollars? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I showed it yesterday for twenty six. Today it is twenty dollars. It is Mark Florence porcelain. It is Marie Antoinette. It is. Uh, Raised and it's just beautiful condition and painted again. I'll show you the maker's mark. It is Florence, it is Marie Antoinette figurine for $20. I just we were talking about it earlier. I just think it's amazing how somebody can. Use the porcelain to make it ridge to feel like lace. Right. All right, it is yours for 20. Yeah, it's an absolutely beautiful piece. And I wanted to definitely find it a new home. So it is yours for 20 in it. Thank you so much. I'm glad it's going to a good place. Nanette. 
Okay. Um, okay, one more lot of Mr. Potato Head, and these are uh, various Mr. Potato Head parts that would come from those big bins. I'm going to do this batch for $20. This one is a bunch of pirate accessories from Disney, or Pirates of the Caribbean. Comes with a parrot. I'll show anything if you want to. Some eyes, some feet for the parrot, a bandana, a couple hats. It says Pirates of the Caribbean on it. That part. And it also comes with all these parts that are from Disney. Again, in those big batches, like an Ariel bottom, two ray guns from Buzz Lightyear, along with a Buzz Lightyear. Uh, Bunch of Mickey ears and Mickey gloves, a clock, a Mickey Mouse, a guitar from the Rock and Roller Coaster, um, a chef's hat from Mickey House, and another pair of ears. Uh, this whole lot of Mr. Potato Head Disney. Again, you can only get a lot of this stuff right downtown Disney or in the parks. Uh, the whole lot of Disney Mr. Potato Head, uh, $20. Do you have her information? She does have a wrench, Nanette does. I just gave her a wrench, and I thought it was, uh, um, I thought I, I got her. I do have her information. Do you have it? Let me, I'll check right now. I okay. do believe so. I looked and I do not, so. Okay. If not, you can just fill out, let me see. Get to the end. I do not too. So if Nina, if you just fill out the job form on the top, so we will have your information. That's what I did. I've seen Nanette all around. I've competed with Nanette in many auctions for stuff. <laughs> I know, as I did. And I, so I was like, she wait, correct, I have she it. collects a lot of the same stuff or resells a lot of the same stuff I look for. <laughs> right. Okay. And that's my three. Thank you so much, Nanette. Okay. I'm back. I have a set of note cards. Let's get it. Note cards. It's a set of four blank note cards. Three dollars. They are handmade. I don't know if that goes that way, but it's made to go that way on accident. You will get four note cards, four envelopes. This is great for resellers. Um, they're sealed in this bag. You get this one. And they are blank in this inside. And you can always get more if you need more. You get that one. And they come with the envelopes. You get that one. And you get that one. So you're getting two of each. Yeah. Two of each, three dollars with the envelope. And I do hold boxes if you let me know that you want me to hold a box. Please do not just not pay either one of us or ghost us until you got enough in your box because it makes us a little like, you know. We don't want to resell the item, but, you know, some of us can't store the item. But if we know that you're going to be back, we appreciate that. It's helpful. That's that's the word I'm looking for. Anybody going on a cruise this summer? <laughs> no, I'm not. But if I was, I'd bring the Versace eyeglass case that I picked up at Teresa's auction for $7. <laughs> this is brand new. It does come in a plastic seal. This is just an example, and it has the cleaning cloth in it. 
I will learn how to use cameras. And it says Versace on the inside, in the black, off the velveteen feeling case. Keep your glasses nice and safe. This can hold reading glasses, crochet hooks, regular eyeglasses, and all sorts of glasses. This is a good gift. You could give somebody the Versace eyeglass case for Mother's Day. You can give it to him for Father's Day. You can give it to him for birthday. And all you have to do is you don't add the Versace glasses. You put this in there like that. And even a little gift card may be attached or, you know, just that on its own is a lovely gift. Because it's probably more than $7. I do not know. But this is labeled and branded Versace. I bought them as genuine Versace's. So I do have more than one. And it's a $7. Buy it now. Versace eyeglass case. Fancy, fancy. I know. I I don't think I could ever own a Versace anything. Me neither. Unless it was this rock diary. And that was my second one. I have a diamond dart kit for $8. This is a big one. This is Upside down and backwards. It is the little house over the river. Little cabin. And it comes with all the diamonds you need to do it. And these fun little teeny tiny packages, which are resealable, which is nice. This is a different kit than the other ones. It's on a different kind of material. It feels a little bit more pliable to when you're framing it so it's not like a rip or anything that is your picture all the codes to the things this one does not however come with the pen i will include a free pen with this this is what did i say eight dollars and this is hi casey hey, welcome hey. back 30 by 40 centimeters so it is the same size as the other one I'll show you the difference in the material. This is the other one. See how it bends. This is this one. This bends a lot easier. Um, the reason I like this better is because it's a little thinner. But the thing is, you can put it on your frame and secure it. And it's easier to shape than the other one might stretch. But, you know, it's up to you which one you want. If you don't have a thing for the beads, I don't have any extras, but I will have to throw in a pen to do it. And that is my three. Versace, that, and uh, what else? Yeah, that was three, right? Yes. Your turn. Okay, for my last round today, I love this piece. And um, I was asking, I think 18, I'm going to lower it today, today only, to 15. This is a either Scandinavian or Swedish mid-century modern glass case. This purplish is cased inside the glass. Uh, pedestal, kind of an abstract dish. It's a pedestal like that. Uh, Neat, neat piece, kind of mid-century modern. I couldn't find much information about it, except that it was either Scandinavian or Swedish. Uh, nice, nice piece. Won't break my heart if I don't sell it, but it is uh, buy it now for $50. Love the way the purplish is uh, encased. It's kind of a purplish red hue. It's very pretty. Just a neat, neat piece. And if there's no interest, we can call that down to a path. 
which doesn't break my heart. It'll probably end up on my shelf. It's a very pretty piece. Okay. This is uh, going to be a starting bit of $6. These are Hazel Atlas snack plates. Kind of a wavy design. There's three of them for $6. Kind of a snack plate that you can put a cup here or a dip uh, cup there. So you can double dip on your own dip, not on the dip on the table. Uh, there are three of these. Those are they perfect are for cocktail parties. Yeah, I believe these to be uh, Hazel Atlas. There are three of them. And I'm going to ask $6 for the three. I'll show you the other two real quick. This is... Alexa. This is, they call them the uh, wavy design because it has kind of looked like a wave here. with The three dots, oval. Uh, six dollars buy it now for the three pieces bargain on Wednesday so I'm not seeing any interest we can call you down as a pass yeah, there's a Okay, my final piece is kind of a practical piece. I'm going to ask a buy it now. Oh, $5. It is a perfect brownie pan set. I don't know whether it's been used or not, but it is in fabulous condition. Don't think it's ever been used. Everything is there. It comes with a perfect brownie, gooey, chewy recipe guide, and all the pieces here. I guess the this is a cutter to make it further, and it comes out the bottom here. So it's got all the pieces. As you can see, doesn't look like it's been used. It looks very, very clean. Uh, buy it now, along with the gooey, chewy, perfect brownie recipe book with the perfect brownie cake pan set. Five dollars. This probably could make me only... Wow, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I thought there might be... It didn't come with the cups, but I thought it might have came with a, a glass or a cup. I just thought they were neat when I picked them up. They are neat. These those, are, brownie, those work well too. I've had to, I bought the brownie thing before. Oh yeah, I, I could probably even make perfect brownies with this thing. And I'm not a very good baker. I'm an air fryer ma master. That's there you go. Stroke of my <laughs> Cakes. That's yeah. Wow. Yeah. Doesn't that black centerpiece come out anyway? So you can yep. use that pan for other The black things. centerpiece comes right out. Yeah, that's and a nice And the pan. bottom also comes out. Nice. Yeah. You probably even do cornbread in this. Sweet yeah. cornbread. I love sweet cornbread. Oh, so do I. I used to live in Georgia for a while, and they loved their cornbread, but they didn't make sweet cornbread. They made... It was crumply and dry, but they loved it that way. I like my Jiffy cornbread. <laughs> yeah, that's what we use. My husband adds corn. Oh, wow. What a great idea that is, too. Bite-sized meatloaf. Oh, yeah, I love meatloaf, go. too. The sliders. Perfect for sliders. sliders. Yeah. Well, I, I might not be depressed if I don't sell this now. <laughs> you might have to learn how to cook. <laughs> That's my problem. I've got so much stuff, and I don't get depressed when I don't sell some of it. <laughs> Way too <Yeah>. much of it. <laughs> I'm the same. I have a living room I have to get rid of. <laughs> That's my three. And off to Teresa for her final round. 
Oh, who was going to just bring us both up? Okay, that's fine. Let me change cameras. You ready? Okay. Here I am. There you are. Hello. Nice to see you. It's been an auction today. It was a lot of fun to be here. It was really nice. And um, Tooch and I will be back together again on Wednesday. Next Wednesday. Yeah. I did want to, uh, I'm sorry? Yeah, I said next Wednesday. 10.30 a.m. All of yeah. my shows on my channel are at 10.30 a.m. And I do have an announcement. Um, I did ask first before I say anything. And Johnny wanted me to share this with you. His channel has been taken down. So there will be no hump day auction today. There will be nothing tomorrow morning. This is breaking my heart. <laughs> and it's not my channel. But so we have to all pray for Johnny and yep. support him the best way we can. He started because... the appeal process and hopefully it was just a bot taking it down. It obviously hope... happened so quick that it wasn't a uh, human that looked at it. Hopefully we right. get to human to look at it and uh, something similar happened to Nady Pie, but they just took down a video of his. So, yeah, he this got some almost a next day answer, and he was right back up with that video. So let's hope and pray. Let's hope it's not that it happens because he's such yes. an integral and important part of this community. He is. He uh, is. So truly. let's say say some prayers for Johnny to to get him yeah. back up so he can start helping all of us like he's helped Bro. me on. Again soon, right. and um, right. it's, that's it what he's saying. We're all there for him, and right, it will turn out okay. Where it happened to a friend of mine too a couple of weeks ago, but he, he was totally it. It was just a bad experience, and I'm just mm -hmm. really hopeful and prayerful that yeah, because it happened care to care a that. couple of years ago, and I remember that was the first day that I um actually found Johnny it was the last day of his old channel. But he knew what happened there. He actually saw yeah. what happened. This right. time, he had no clue what is going on. So it's just, it makes me think it was a bot. I'm hoping. That I'm hoping. Down. And hopefully he can get, it's tough to get to a person at YouTube, but let's hope they answer his emails and his appeals quickly and get him back up where he belongs, right here on the YouTubes. Right. What can we do without the, the grand godfather of the YouTubes? Uh, absolutely. Absolutely. <clears throat> Okay. 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 Let us, uh, let us know, Johnny, that. and we will definitely get that out as much as we can to everybody. I'm going to put this up here. He's trying to get a new link set up for today's show. So hold on, people. The man has worked miracles before. I tell you, this guy can pull it out. I don't know how he continues with the days he keeps in the hours. He keeps. <laughs> I really don't. I, I and he's a fierce sure. competitor out there sourcing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we a, a Christmas, uh, and he was kind of chuckling. Oh, Tucher's over there. There's probably nothing over there. And he came over and he found treasures all over. And he was like, Tucher's yeah. trying to find this. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So let's hope. We got a half hour, guys. Please keep an eye out. I put this up there so you can hit Cajun Roots Cuisine. And, um, that's probably, I'm assuming that's where you're going to be today, Johnny. We're going to follow you wherever you may lead us. And whatever you need, Johnny. Yeah, we're, we're here for you. you. We're all going to pray for you. Huge community Johnny. and family behind you. Yeah. Yeah. A, a lot of us wouldn't even be here without Johnny. Absolutely. It would not be here without Johnny. Absolutely. So we'd definitely hold that close bond. And there's, and there's more than. 20 or 30 of us that are the same situation. Yeah. yeah exactly. Well, as thank busy you. as Emmy always takes as many minutes as you need to exactly, you yeah. with whatever you're doing. And he's a busy man with all his platforms and all his videos and all that. Exactly. And all his morning show. I mean, he's Absolutely. so busy. It's amazing. He's so busy. Well, on that sad note, but we're going to be praying that we get to Go to Cajun Roots Cuisine. I should look it up really quick. Talk amongst yourselves. Talk to you. I'm going to try to get that link. Okay. Yep. 
Well, because you got I the chat as quick as we can, and uh, I'll take a peek for it. Um, and that way you can go there to Cajun uh, Roots Cuisine to see if uh, he's going to put a uh, link for an auction, the hump day auction, so he can continue to go. In. I'm sure even if it takes some time, you can't put too many obstacles in the way of Johnny. He gets over, around them, under them, whatever it takes. <laughs> yeah, right. And he's definitely got an army standing behind him, in I, front of him, around him. I am, I am uh, subscribed to him on the next, uh, the other one. So, but I'm gonna add my link in the, the his link in the chat. Let's go anyway, over. Yeah, uh, just put him. it up. Just put it up. Th thank you so much. I... There we go. Thank you guys. Thank you, Don't everybody. Let's go to there this. And so, any updates from Johnny and? Uh... Yeah. Go subscribe. Send some love in the in the community page. Let's fill them up with our love and prayers. Okay, guys. I know Pearl. It just won't happen. It won't be Wednesday because we don't have our um, Johnny at Hump Day. That's why we always end our show at twelve thirty so that you have time to get a beverage. You know, have a bio That's break. Funny. Every day I write that I bring this gentleman to his day program. Uh, up, he lives in Rutland, and there's a farm in Rutland that I ride by every day, twice a day, that has a camel in the field. Oh, cool. And he, sometimes he's right next to the road. And every Wednesday, I ride by that camel, and they must think I'm crazy because they probably hear me in the neighborhood. I yell, I'm baby! Yeah! <laughs> That's I know. I yell it, but I still think it every day when I ride by that camel. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Well, hopefully he's there. But now we all have his link. If you haven't subscribed, let's fill him up. Um, and that'll help him feel the love that we have for him. Okay, guys. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank Perfect. you so much for stopping by. And uh, we'll see you next time. And hopefully see you on a hump day auction or an auction real soon. Check out Don and Yarn on Friday with Don's deals with Yarn again. And I'll be back here Wednesday. I've got a week off from doing live auctions just to get some stuff together and get the shipping out and get the invoicing done. And then the That's following great. Sunday, I'm on with Mark and Mike to all guys, fourth Sunday of every month. And we'll see you in the chats. That's true. We'll see you in the chats. Thank you, guys. Thank you for going over to Johnny's. I see some of you saying you did. Thank, Thank you, you for filling out the form. And I'll be invoicing tomorrow. Have a blessed day, guys. Thank, Thank you, you so again. Bye-bye.